Recently, not a lot has been happening in the Splatoon Twitter scene. So, because I need content, I've turned this episode of Splatoon Twitter drama into a quick fire round. Ready, set, go! First off, Inky X Kitty. You'll remember her from such memorable tweets as... Faking her own... <laughs> yes, well... On June 16th, Kitty wanted to know if people would still want to have her back after she, uh... <clears throat> trivialized human life. Well, over 700 people voted before she deleted the tweet, that is, and the majority voted no. There is humor in that. I would have laughed if I still had my sense of humor. Alas, people like Kitty killed it. Next! Clock Gun is a very forgettable Splatoon source artist. He is no one of note. He has about 200 YouTube subscribers and about 50 Twitter followers. He also makes NSFW Splatoon Gmod art. Again, nothing out of the ordinary there. However, the person he made this art for is a 12-year-old girl. You're a diddler, mate. It doesn't help that you're being creepy towards this girl either. Yes, these are different girls. At least she gave me an excuse to make a very bad Hobbit reference. And every day I get to quote smoke is a successful day to me. Next! Rudy Octoling VA. I've talked about her in passing in a few videos here and there, and my opinion on her is not hard to figure out. I have no respect for someone who sends rather thinly veiled death threats to people. However, this story concerned an old friend of the channel. The Canadian Spartan. It's been too long. Far, far too long. And for once, my dear Spartan, I'm not going to tear you a new one today. No, in fact, I'm going to defend you for this one. You see, my dear audience, Spartan is quite open about wanting to leave the Splatoon community. He's also quite open about doing it for views, but that's not the point. Rudy is someone Spartan liked to refer to as his best friend. And this best friend tried to emotionally manipulate Spartan into making Splatoon content again. Now, at first I thought she did this because she wanted to be in his videos for that sweet, sweet YouTuber exposure. But when I actually asked Spartan myself, he denies she ever said anything about wanting to be in his animations. Oh well. Don't manipulate people, Rudy. It's not a good look. And all because you don't want the content to stop coming. Just learn to animate yourself, lass. Problem solved. 